Okay, let's defeat this demon. I keep calling it a dragon instead of demon. That must be very. Bet you I could kill it in two Ooh, blows. Yeah. Okay, Elder. Can I get you a ladder so you can get your point back? You dare attack me? You dare attack me? On the master's electricity, bitch. Good job. I've never felt this way before. It's strange. Why make us face a spirit or a demon for the Halloween? Because they're sadistic bastards, that's why. And I'm not talking about demons. Everyone must face the harrowing because there's a small chance a mage might become possessed and become an abomination. Thrown to the mercy of a demon when you're at your weakest. For the safety of all. Mages cannot be the only ones at risk of position. Which they aren't, position. but power attracts attention. Maybe it's entering the fade awake. Not a gentle process. I don't really know. Magic is evil, and therefore, so are you. They'll never change. The circle is a prison. You have choices between joining and suffering various deaths of body or spirit. Remember that. Is there no way I can help you get out of here? Out of here? Out of the Fade? I don't know. I don't have a body waiting for me. It's not something I try to think about. Stay here too long and it's like being adrift. Pieces of you float away until you're not even a memory. Are you certain? I have no example to compare myself against. Only people like you taking the harrowing. Mages, real ones that come here, they ignore me. They think I'm a spirit pretending to be me. I don't want to talk about it anymore. Let's just get you out of here. Huh. Must be the only one that talked to him. There he is. he would be waiting for us. I got the rock shield on. It's time to be the fun. Here we go. And there is a spirit of rage. And so it comes to me at last. Soon I shall see the land of the living with your eyes, creature. You shall be mine, body and soul. If I lose, the Templars will still cut you down. They are welcome to try. So this creature is your offering, Mouse. Another plaything as per our arrangement. Arrangement. I'm not offering you anything. I don't have to help you anymore. Oh. And after all those wonderful meals we have shared, now suddenly the mouse has changed the rules. I'm not a mouse now, and soon I won't have to hide. I don't need to bargain with you. We shall see. Oh, booger booger. When you came, I hoped that maybe you might be able to, but I never really thought any of you were worthy. The ones you betrayed before me, what were their names? What? They were not as promising as you. It was a long time ago. Uh, I don't remember their names. I don't even remember my own name. It's the Fade. And the Templars killing me. 
Like they tried with you. Anything to, anything to survive, like an animal or worse. I am what the Fade has made me. Am I to blame for that? Deciding to exist or not exist is not a fair choice. I had no hope. You have shown me other possibilities. If you want to help, there may be a way for me to leave here, to get a foothold outside. You just need to want to let me in. I'm starting to think the other demon was my test. What? What do you... Of course it was. What else is here that could harm an apprentice of your potential? <laughs> you are a smart one. Simple killing is a warrior's job. The real dangers of the Fade are preconceptions, careless trust, pride. Keep your wits about you, mage. True tests never end. Oh my goodness, that's creepy. I have to, I have to say, mages had to do the worst things. Come break my heart. Are you alright? Say something, please. John? Oh, I'm glad you're all right. They carried you in this morning. I didn't even realize you'd been gone all night. I've heard about apprentices who never come back from harrowings. Is it really that dangerous? What was it like? We're friends, but don't ask this. You know I can't tell you. Huh, so much for friendship. I'll leave you alone then. And now you get to move to the nice mage's quarters upstairs. I'm stuck here and I don't know when they'll call me for my harrowing. Don't worry so much about it. Easy for you to say. I've been here longer than you have. Sometimes I think they just don't want to test me. What are you talking about? The Tranquil never go through a harrowing. You do the harrowing, the right of tranquility, or you die. That's what happens. They're not going to kill you. They might not. But the right of tranquility is just as bad, maybe worse. You've seen the tranquil around the tower, like Owain who runs the stockroom. He's so cold. No, not even cold. There's just nothing in him. It's like he's dead but still walking. His voice, his eyes, are lifeless. What did he do to him? He's been made tranquil. I don't know how they do it exactly, but you're cut off from the Fade. It takes away your magic abilities, along with your dreams and emotions. How awful. Apprentices can ask to be made tranquil if they fear the harrowing, but the Circle also forces tranquility on those they feel are weak. And sometimes they force it upon apprentices they think might be too dangerous as mages. I shouldn't waste your time with this. I was supposed to tell you to see Irving as soon as you woke up. Where is he? He said he'd be in his study upstairs. You'd better not keep him waiting. We can speak later. Did you hear anything? Is she all right? Is she awake? Why do you care? Are you best friends now? I'm just curious. That Templar, Cullen, said it was the quickest, cleanest harrowing he'd ever seen. He says she's very talented and very brave. Well, he would, wouldn't he? I just know I'll be terrified when my time comes, like Wendell was. He'd throw up every day for the next week just thinking about it. Well, snappy little bitch, you are. I want to follow you all the way to your destination, bitch. Where you gonna go? You gonna pray? You gonna go I'll talk to this princess right here? Yeah, you make it weird. Jalen's been acting weird all day. Have you seen him? Yeah. 
see. More willpower, magic, more health. Oh, friendly fire, my ass. Stone. Let's see if I have the belt on. Ew, I got this. Bam. I don't like the color though. It's so ugly. Should have made it a different color. I'm terrible at spells. You're lucky you're so talented. Why? Jealously will not get you nowhere. Practice makes perfect, bitch. Can't talk to her. And she was the one who was worried about me. Ooh, Nicholas. Very good. Hello, anybody in here? I really hate how the Templars are always staring at us. I heard Humbert volunteered to take the right of tranquility. How awful! Blood magic. To your will. That's what I hear, anyway. You talking about blood magic? That's a no-no. This tower is too cold. I know. It's too cold. The sparkles were wearing dresses. I mean, robes. <laughs> so much. You must control. the fire with your will. Keep the flames steady. We don't want it sputtering and leaping about. That's what causes most of the injuries. Injuries? But... but... Steady. It reacts to your emotions. If you panic, it will... No, no, no. Breathe. <laughs> oh. Oh. You know, in my experience, flint and tinder works just as well. Maybe we should start with that. Okay. <coughs> oh god, what was that? I hope I don't have the hiccups. That would be really bad. I'm just taking them just to be taking them. Let's see. Going back over to see if I missed anything. Don't know. Gregor hasn't said anything yet. And shh, we're on duty. Yeah, there's no one here. Someone's always watching. I swear it's like a wall of lies. Hey, did you hear about that apprentice they're going to send for? Shh. Shh. <laughs> At least you get to walk around. I'm stuck guarding this door for another three hours. <laughs> yes, is there something you need? No, have a nice day. The same to you. At least you walk around. I'm stuck there for three hours. I like how kind they are to me, though. Maybe it's because I'm a gall. If I was a dude, they'd probably be like, Who are you, you filthy mongrel? Go back in with your nasty blood magic. I mean, your magic. He's a blood mage. Kill him. Was the harrowing scary? It must have been. Why else would they call it that? Yep. I hope you've spoken to the first enchanter. He seems eager to see you. I really should be concentrating on the flame. Good luck. Do any of you remember what the Chantry says about magic? Magic must serve man and not rule over him. Very good. 
And what do you think that means? Can anyone tell me? Only boys can do magic. <laughs> no, that's not what it means. It means that magic should be used to help people, but we can't use our magic to... to force people to do what we want. That's right. We should not abuse the gift the Maker has given us. Hey. The Templars scare me. They always look so mean. Boys are better at magic than girls. Being in the tower is much better than being on the farm. I remember when you were this age. Adorable. <laughs> You're out too much fun with the kids now. Gerda told me the Templars watch us while we bathe. I hope that's not true. Let's make sure that's a... I hear Irving's waiting to give you your mage robes. I don't want them. Concentrate. Hold the shield. I'm terrible at spells. <gasps> you're lucky you're so talented. Pathetic. If I had put all my power behind that spell, you would have been obliterated. I am not your enemy. Fear is your enemy. It is a weakness that can be exploited. Should you face a demon with your will wavering so... <laughs> no? Then stand firm and know you can resist whatever I throw at you. Again. <gasps> oh. How does it feel to be done with the harrowing? Sucks. Oh, I feel great. Now oh, it's stuck in that one place with that one color anymore. I can't wait for my harrowing. Found so proud. Jowan's been acting weird all day. Have you seen him? Yeah, he talked to me a moment ago. He does act weird. It's time to go upstairs. It's time to go upstairs. <sighs> I can't believe I, I answer all those riddles right, even though my sister was helping me. You ready to shut up? Welcome to the Circle Stockroom of Magical Items. My name is Owain. How may I assist you? Are you really a tranquil mage? I voluntarily submitted to the right of tranquility. I was unwilling to undergo the harrowing. I find this state agreeable. What is the... oh, you crack it. You actually like being this way? I see the world with clarity. I remember the days when my mind was filled with inconvenient and seething emotions. Now things are simple. What happened during the rite of tranquility? Tranquility. Cruelly. Oh, okay, I can't speak. I was ordered to never speak of it. I cannot go against the circle's wishes. And you're no longer a person. My body is similar in form to yours, possessing an equal number of limbs, appendages, and internal organs. I perform the same physical functions. My mind is capable of higher thought processes. Am I to be denied personhood because I do not feel as you do? A person is more than just physical parts. I have thoughts and memories. I remember my past, my childhood in the tower, and my apprenticeship. These experiences defined me. My lack of emotion simply adds to what is already there. Perhaps you're right. Personhood is not measurable. Therefore, we should let this rest. There she go. Very well. Goodbye. But I don't like when y'all talk like that. It's creepy. Is there something you need? You must speak to Owain. If you want something from the stock room, you must speak to Owain. Your mentors must be happy for you. You passed the harrowing. Anybody here? Oh, excuse me, I didn't hear you come in. I'm sorry, I'm terribly busy right now. I have to prepare the room before the Grey Warden is done at his meeting with Irving. There's a Grey Warden here? 
Yes, Duncan his name is. He must be here to talk to Irving about something important. You know, I almost became a Grey Warden once. Really? There were several of us chosen, though the Grey Wardens only wanted one recruit. Uh, they only ever have one mage, you see. I think they thought I was the best candidate, but I was young and foolish, and I said I wasn't interested. They picked someone else instead, and that was that. I've regretted it ever since. Ah, oh, well, I should get back to my work. Good day. Yeah, but what the hell were you doing? He was sneaking around somewhere.